Hello, everyone. And this video is for uh, one particular viewer who asked me for some guidance or some help, if possible. However, um, if you clicked on it and you're watching, who knows? There might be a message in here for you. So where do we start? Well, we'll start with the obvious here. I'm messing around with virtual backgrounds and uh, not sure I like it, but what the heck, I thought it would be fun for this video. Um, and I took this picture, <laughs> so there you go. So when I tuned in intuitively, what I got for you is I immediately saw this huge downed tree, very, I mean, very large, like a big redwood. And there was a male, um, uh, I would assume that you're male, although I, I don't know anything about you just based on your YouTube name. Um, and what I saw was this young man there standing, I guess, wanting to cut the tree or deal with the tra tree. And all he had was this small little hatchet. And I thought to myself, my goodness, this person needs help. <laughs> and he needs help. He, he, he thinks he can handle this on his own as you know all of our little egos think that we can i can take care of this myself and we totally forget to ask others for help so that's the image that i got i said oh he should ask his family or ask the family and then of course i went to um throw a hexagram and later on i did another intuitive check-in and i saw that um there was some arguing with your family. So I don't know if this is family related. Well, it had it is family related. So I'll, I'll get to that point. So when I threw for the hexagram, <clears throat> I was shocked, but not surprised that I got hexagram 37, which is called the family. So the message that the sage wants you to hear uh, regarding this issue, this problem, um, the family refers to, of course, our human family, but our cosmic family. And it says in here in the I Ching that um, the person who receives this hexagram needs to know that no matter what the situation, you can call on and urge to do so, to call on your cosmic family for help, and they will be there to help you. So in this situation, you do need some cosmic help. Um, so please call on the sage, call on your helpers, wh whomever you speak to, uh, because they are standing by ready to help you. And, I'll, um, and you received line five. And the message for line five is, let me put this down. Let me read my notes. Look at my notes here. So you are to call on your cosmic family for help, no matter what the circumstances. And line five oops, just lost my place, indicates that this issue has to do something with, let me find my place again, sorry. So this line counsels a person that he needs to rid himself of the idea and belief that you need to be authorized to do the things that you want to do. Um, so it says that there's a situation and you want to do something and you feel like you need approval for something, you need to be legitimized. And when I checked in with the sage and did a, a little oracle session, it indicated that, you know, um, this is more societal pressure and collective pressure, but the family is a little bit involved. Like there's something that you want to do. Uh, excuse me, there is something the family wants you to do, and you don't want to do it. Um, and also, you think that what you want to do needs approval from the collective, or perhaps you need a certificate or, so, or some degree to do something, or it's not society, uh, maybe culturally acceptive, accepted. And so this is causing a lot of conflict within you. Um, let me read further here. It says that your inner gifts are being dampened. You're, it's like basically your whole inner truth and your soul is being dampened, tamped down due to this uh, inability for you to do what you want. 
um, it says the person whose abilities have been denied believes that he cannot do what comes naturally to him. He cannot paint because he has not studied art. Um, his way of expressing himself is invalid because he is not he is not certified. So this is the type of thing I'm speaking of. And it says, you know, he has spells on him that say, who has authorized you to do that, right? Seeking approval. Um, such a person may need to rid himself of the belief uh, in obedience to authority. So perhaps you are in a cultural setting that's really ingrained in, you know, obeying your elders, um, uh, social norms. Um, and what I'm getting from the sage is you have to say no to all of that. And the spell that you need to release from yourself to uh, call upon the sage and the helpers to say no, no, no to this spell is that you need approval by others to be who you are or what you want to do in life to follow your path. Um, so in Gene Key's uh, terms, this hexagram is called weakness and it's feeling of lack of support um, lack of support of the family which i i get a sense that this is happening and by the way if you don't if what i'm saying intuitively is is totally wrong i know that there's a nugget in here that will resonate with you um that will resonate with you. So regardless of if any of my intuitive gets or whatever are wrong, it doesn't matter. There is going to be something in here for you. Um, yeah, so weakness also has to do, this particular gene key has to do with um, the male masculine energy in a person or in the world in society who's much stronger, has the, the authoritarian role and when I asked the sage, I asked, is this about uh, this person's feminine side? And I'm not necessarily speaking about sexuality, but it does include sexuality. Is it being tamped down? And um, what I mean by feminine side, I mean the creative aspect in you is being at, tamped down and needs to be released. And I got a big hit, ding, ding, ding. Like this is, a, this is it, that your creative feminine side is being tamped down and whether that's in creative projects something you want to do in life or sexuality it doesn't matter this is what's being tamped down and the sage indicated that perhaps your family may not be supportive but that you have to go it alone go it alone and i say that in quotes because now you must call upon your cosmic family for help and they will guide you. They will give you the authority to um, and the ability to say no to the outside constructs, and they will help you uh, going forward. Um, the cosmic, and you will receive help as long as there's a sincerity and modesty and without arrogance and without the belief, um, if you're used to authoritarian culture, that somehow the sage and the helpers and your higher self are higher than you, better than you, or have authority over you. They want you to know that everything, they view you as completely uh, equal. All things are e equal. But in this, um, in this instance for you, the sage indicated that he is viewing you as the king that you need help and they are going to serve you at this point, as long as you approach with modesty and sincerity and openness to their guidance. Okay, let me see what else. Um, this is about you releasing your creative side to do what you want, ding, ding, ding. Um, ask the cosmic family for help. You are not alone. You don't have to chop down this huge tree all by yourself with, without the proper tools. The proper tools are your cosmic family. And of course, your heart, your inner truth. Um, by all means, uh, let that be your authority above all else. And I hope this was helpful. Okay. And if anyone else needs help, just let me know. <laughs>